Let's take a look at this problem. We got uh, x plus y is equal to 12, and y is equal to 5x. And they want us to solve this by substitution method. First I'll do it with the substitution method, and then I'll do it on the calculator. Now our first step. Solve one of the equations for one of the variables. I'm going to choose the second one. The reason why is because it's already solved for y, so then that step's done. Step two, then plug that into your other equation. So we got x plus y is equal to 12. And we just said y is equal to 5x, so we're going to place the y here with 5x. So we're going to have x plus 5x equals 12. Now the second step actually says, uh, now plug that into your other equation and then solve. You notice after I've done my substitution, um, I don't have y anymore. So I can solve this. x plus 5x is 6x equals 12. And then I'll divide both sides by 6. And we end up with x is equal to 2. Step 3. We then want to plug that into the equation from step 1. Step 1, we have y is equal to 5x. And we just said x is 2. So we're going to plug 2 in for the x. And then we want to uh, solve this. Uh, nothing exciting here. You just take 5 times 2, which is 10. So our answer will be 210. Okay. Now if I do this on the calculator, I have to do a little bit of rearranging. I'm going to take this 5x, move it to the left side, and it becomes a negative 5x. And then plus y is equal to 0. You have to have all of your variable terms, uh, all the terms of the variables on one side, and your numbers, constant terms, on the other side. And they have to be lined up. X's have to be in the same column, Y's have to be in the same column, and numbers on the other side equals. Well, the matrix goes with this is 1, 1, 12, negative 5, 1, 0. We drop the X's, Y's, and um, the equals, and keep the numbers in their signs. Now, rows by columns, this is two rows by three columns. So we'll go input this in. On my calculator, I'm going to do second x to negative 1, that's our inverse button. Right arrow over to edit, enter on A. Size of matrix 2 by 3, so I do 2 enter, 3 enter. And then I'll type in my numbers. So I got 1 enter, 1 enter, 12 enter, negative 5 enter, 1 enter, 0 enter. Then I'll exit out, do second mode. I won't go back in my matrix menu, so I do second x to negative 1, right arrow to math, and up arrow to RREF. Make sure you choose one of two R's, press enter. Go back in my matrix menu, second x to negative 1, enter on A, enter again. Okay, what we come up with is 1, 0, 2, 0, 1, 10. Now two equations, two variables. Our first 2 by 2 square here should be at diagonal 1, 0, 0 else. That's what REF uh, means in, in terms of this problem solving. So we see that, so that means it worked. And our answer is the far right column. So this will be x and this will be y. The order of our answers is the order of our columns here. I put x's first, and I put y's second. And we write this with uh, parentheses around it, so this would be 2, comma 10. Same answer as when we got it by hand. 